Hey, hey, lobby. What's up, everybody? Grim Green here. So it's last night I streamed the vlog for a really long time, and it was really a really good vlog. And then mm, maybe about an hour after I was done, I got a little notification from YouTube that said, oh, your stream has been locked by YouTube and you cannot appeal this decision. So I ended up talking with someone from YouTube for about an hour last night, and he could not get to the bottom of it either. He escalated it further. Come to find out today, I think it was a glitch that went around and it was happening to a lot of people. With that said, I don't know when I'm gonna get control of the vlog back so that I can, you know, republish it for the hashtag replay crew. So in the meantime, I have a little edited segment from the vlog. This is my state of the channel address. I hope you enjoy it. Boosh, go. Green hat. Oh my God, you guys, news and advocacy. The first thing I wanna mention is my state of this channel address. We've talked about YouTube tons and I'm bored of talking about YouTube. They Every spring, every fall, they go through, they love to give out strikes, they love to give out community guidelines, they love to, ta they love to tackle your videos, they love to pull them down, they love to age gate them, they love to do all sorts of stuff. And it happens twice a year and we're past it now. Maybe not past it, but maybe a little bit past it right now. And it always freaks everybody out. And I would be lying if I said it didn't freak me out. It absolutely freaks me out. My YouTube channel is actively on my mind every single day. Every time I go and sign on YouTube or I do something on YouTube, I think, oh, maybe this is it. Maybe now's the day that my YouTube got taken down. Maybe now's the day that I got two community guideline strikes because they keep rolling out new rules and they expect you to uh, you know, be compliant with them retroactively. I, I wanna make this super crystal clear. I vape. I wanna help smokers become vapors. And I'm gonna do that on this YouTube channel. If it vapes, I wanna review it. I wanna try it. If it's a pod, if it's a mech, if it's an RTA, if it's an RDA, if it's an RDTA, I don't care what it is. If it vapes and it has the potential to help someone who smokes, I want it. I wanna review it on this YouTube channel. That's just plain and simple where I'm at. I'm a lot like Matt Cully. I am a harm reduction absolutist. If it is safer than smoking cigarettes, I, I, I want to review it and I want to get that information out on the internet. Having that stuff on YouTube specifically is incredibly important to me. And people throw things out there all the time like do Daily Motion, do Vimeo, do Rumble. That's fine. There are plenty of places I can store my videos on the internet. It doesn't mean that they're going to get watched. There's pl I have no, lit no lack of places to store my videos on the internet. But what I want to do is get this in front of someone who smokes. That's my, that is my first and only and main loyalty in this world is to people that smoke cigarettes. Because our lives have already been changed. We quit with vaping. We got to quit in the best way possible on earth. No, not no disposables, yes disposables. Yes to whatever is better for you than smoking cigarettes. If it vapes, I wanna make a video for it for this YouTube. I don't care what the product is. I just want it to be vape. I want it to be not a cigarette. Anything else? I will review on this YouTube. And I do it for people that smoke. I do it for people that vape, That you know, whatever, want conflicting opinions on different products. If it vapes, I want to review it. I love reviewing some, you know, some super high end stuff. I love reviewing the Mimo stuff. I love reviewing cloud chasey stuff. I love reviewing pods. I love, love, love harm reduction. It, it's, it's my mission in life. It's my goal in life. If you are someone who smokes, you don't have to smoke. <laughs> you just don't. You don't anymore. Better living through science. I want to get my videos in front of people who smoke. So I will remain on YouTube and I will attempt in every possible way to remain completely compliant so that my videos have the opportunity and have the possibility to get in front of someone who smokes. My second most important loyalty is to the vape community. I have been in this 13 years. I've seen people come and go. I've seen YouTubers rise and fall, and I am here for it. I love this community, even the toxic parts of it. I, st I still like it. 
I like that people kind of rally together and I like that we celebrate vape anniversaries and I like that we celebrate when people quit smoking. I love that. That's what I'm here to do. I am here to proselytize the good news of vaping. If I could make vaping like my religion, I would. W words can't describe how much I believe in vaping and how much I believe it's going to completely change the world and save billions of lives. And that's my priority. So my YouTube is going to be packed with reviews and videos of everything that vapes. We're going to continue doing TBN every other Tuesday. I'm going to start mixing some build streams back in. We got the vlog going strong literally every Thursday except for next week. <laughs> Harm reduction is my passion, and that's what I'm here to do. And, and I'm not going to go and start another YouTube channel that is gardening or playing Zelda or any uh, like I, I that sounds fun sure I'd love to play Zelda on the internet and you know what sometimes I do play Zelda on the internet on Twitch but that's just entertainment I, I want to provide a service for people I, I feel like there's a responsibility here to people that smoke that you're providing a service if you review vape products on YouTube or on the internet you're providing a service to people you're providing something tangible something they can take with them some advice some sort of little you know tidbits or helpful things or like check your battery wraps glow your coils little helpful things or, you know we're, we're, we're improving the world I'm not improving the world. I'm not doing anything by playing video games on Twitch. It's fun, but it's not, it doesn't fulfill me like getting that email from Susan, who's 65, who just picked up a pod system because I reviewed it and now is a year combustion free, is now six months combustion free. There's no feeling on earth that feels like that. And that is what keeps me on YouTube every day. And that's what drives me insane with YouTube and jumping through all of these hoops to remain on YouTube because that's what's the most important. So I just want to make that very clear. I'm here for you. I'm down for the cause. I, I will never, ever, ever abandon vaping. This is so much more important than literally anything I've ever done in my life. And I roasted coffee and I, like I've done a lot of things. Nothing Nothing to me has been as important as this. So that's where we're at. That's the state of this YouTube. We have been serving smokers since 2009. We have been cultivating an incredible community of really helpful, loving, wonderful people that also want to help smokers. And we are not slowing down literally ever. I will fight with my last breath for tobacco harm reduction. I will not stop until vaping is safe, legal, accessible, and flavored for any adult that smokes. Let's check on the uh, smoking statistics, shall we? How many people have uh, died since we started? 922 people have died worldwide because of cigarette smoking since we started the vlog. 922 people. That is unacceptable to me. Those are preventable deaths as far as I'm concerned. Better living through science and we have technology that can end smoking. And that's that's what I'm here to do. That's that's my mission in life. And speaking of my mission in life, that was the State of the Union uh, address from Grim Green about this channel. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's like 10.30 and I'm uh, just gonna smoke, so.